I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. From the Tor Nation Production Studio, here is anchor Isaiah Courtney. Reporting from the worldwide headquarters of Tor Nation Productions, located at Baja School in Galveston, Texas, welcome to Good Morning Baja. I'm Isaiah Courtney. The Ball High Women's Soccer Program will continue holding tryouts through tomorrow after school. For more information, please contact either Coach Creighton in Room 1056 or Coach Pardo in Room 1023. This year's annual ABC 13 Share Your Holidays Food Drive will be held on Friday, December 7th. As always, the local drop-off site will be here at Ball High School out front on Avenue O by the clock. Everybody is invited to participate. Non-perishable food items may be dropped off from 6 a.m. to 12 noon on December 7th. For more information, please see Mr. Dudas. And if you've written a poem that you would like to share with the world, submit your work to Mr. Carpenter in room 2033 or email them to tomcarpenter at jisd.org. And your work can be published in the Ball Street Journal's online edition. The poem's subject and content must meet Mr. Peller's approval. A panel of English teachers will determine the top three entries and they will be published in the next printed issue of the Ball Street Journal. If you've ever wanted to be a published author, take advantage of this opportunity. All authors retain the copyright to their work. And checking today's national calendar, it's National Day of Giving. Now here's today's Fitness Minute with Annette Hammond. It's the Fitness Minute with fitness expert Annette Hammond. I am not an advocate of eating fast food. With a little planning and self-control, you can skip the fast food restaurants and keep to your low-calorie, healthy eating. But I also know that the holidays are hectic, and many more Americans opt to eat fast food because of time crunches. If that's you, be mindful of what you are ordering. First, choose water instead of soda. That one decision can drastically cut the calories. Second, be aware of what you are eating. Just because it's a salad doesn't mean it's healthy or low calorie. Many have fried chicken, bacon, or are loaded with cheese. Some fast food restaurants offer healthy choices like yogurt, oatmeal, veggie subs, and turkey wraps. Look for meals under 350 calories. Take time to study the menu and make good choices. For the Fitness Minute, I'm Annette Hammond. Here's today's Words You've Never Heard segment. It's Words You've Never Heard. Gifts may gladden girls, but they seem to burden guys. That's what a recent study by Live Science says. Women respond with happy gratitude when they receive a present. But when a man unwraps a gift, he immediately feels a sense of obligation to the giver. Even those women who really don't like getting presents are pretty good at faking a smile. What do you call a person who fakes a smile? an exodesiast. According to psychologists, men tend to keep mental notes of what they got from whom and check it against their own generosity. Women, on the other hand, take gift giving much less seriously. I guess ever since Eve gave Adam the apple, there's been trouble between sexes about gifts. Have you ever unwrapped a G food jet? That's another name for any gift you'd just rather put in the garbage. It's marching down. I'm Carolyn Davidson, and you can have fun challenging your words you never heard vocabulary with my free app, Too Funny for Words. And here's what's turning today on social media. A swan attacks an elephant. Take a look at these adorable dogs shopping for themselves. And No Shave November is almost over. Back to you, Isaiah. Now stay tuned for today's Time Rewind, courtesy of our good friend, Dave Mendel. <laughs> It's Time Rewind for November 27th. It's 1968, and President-elect Richard Nixon asks Harvard professor Henry Kissinger to be his national security advisor, a position Kissinger accepts. 
1971, the Soviet's unmanned Mars 2 spacecraft becomes the first man-made object to reach the surface of the red planet. New Beatles tunes spill onto the pop chart in 1967 as the Fab Four release the Magical Mystery Tour album. Rock legend Jimi Hendrix is born in Seattle on this day in 1942. While his mainstream career spanned only four years, he's considered one of the most influential electric guitarists in the history of popular music. Sadly, he dies of a drug overdose at the age of 27. Learn more about what happened on this day at time-rewind.com. I'm David Mendel. In addition to the website, Time Rewind can also be found on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Check it out for even more pop culture and trivia. I'm Isaiah, and have a terrific day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.